My name is Dorian J. Dura. Most people know me as J. Dura. What inspired me about my 2020 mural in um, Gallery Place? Uh, it was a, a painting of a young man, a young boy, um, holding a sign in my neck. And um, what I, to me, this this whole movement really impacts, or really will have an impact on young people going forward. And I th I think it's important that young people, especially like children, are not afraid. Don't grow up being afraid of being a cop. We need to end this now. Um, they shouldn't be afraid of cops. And um, so I had a very young boy saying in my necks because it could, I mean, there was actually an incident of a 12 year old boy who got shot by a cop. So, um, and I just wanted to make, I mean, most people can relate to children or the innocence of children. And I think it, it hit home more because of the youth of the boy. Different because, first of all, I didn't expect to be painting the mural that day. I was supposed to be helping out. But um, they said that we'd be honored if you paint, a, or be pleased if you could paint a mural. Um, so, so I just went, I went and got my, my equipment and I, and I was coming up with the idea as I was going to get my equipment. Cause I mean, you know, my paint and brushes and everything. Cause I, normally I try to sketch it out, have some type of sketch and I didn't have one at the time, but I think it turned out pretty well. Public art can have a great impact on the community by enhancing, enhancing the community. Normally when art goes into a community, it, it br brings up the property value. But not only that, it, um, it inspires the people to live in that community. Um, it um, makes them feel that their, their, their home is valuable. I mean, no matter what, what type of condition, they could be low income housing, you know, mid income housing or, or you know, high end of income housing. But I think the art just, it enhances and it, it uplifts the, the um, community. You know, the messages in the art, the colors in the art, it um, enlivens the community. Of course, I mean we. Everybody needs some enlightenment right now, or some some joy, a little joy, any type of joy right now. Going through this coronavirus and um, just this racial unrest, it's it's just um, you know, it's a lot of people are probably going through all types of personal stresses, and it all it takes is just maybe uh, just some color to to brighten up their day. So um, I think right now is very important that art be, be in our communities. What part does art play in the Black Lives Matter movement? Um, art is, is documenting the, this time for us. Art is, um, you know, they say art, what do you say? Uh, or somebody may have already said art says a thousand words, but, but a, a picture can say a thousand words pretty much. So, I mean, we, we're telling our stories of this time It'll be documented from for years and years to come, and it's very important that um, we that we be the ones to tell a story about what's going on in our community. One of the main challenges of painting large mural is getting the proportions right because it's um you're not used to uh, you're not always used to, well some folks are not used to painting that that large and it, um you, there's different methods to get it to uh, to get the proportions right. You could use graphs or grids uh, and or, and at the time, I'm, I'm not, I'm not too versed on using grids, so I have to just freestyle it and step okay. back and look, use my eyes. So I, I hope that they, um, they, um, the question is, am I next? And that they, that resonates with them. The, I hope that they, um, when they see my mural, that the um, question of am I next resonates with them, and about their children and their children to come. Um, should they be, are uh, should they be concerned about being next? And um, they should not. And um, we need to make sure that they're not that they're not concerned about that. If everything has been going on, my words of encouragement would be just, it's based on my faith. Our God is, is in control. God's in control. And he's going to take care of his people. So just stay faithful. And we will see better days.